two. One. Oolong. Hi folks, my name is Freedom, and I am running for president. We are here with the Victorian party. I would like to give all people a overview of what the terrorism attack was like, so why don't you come along with me? These are the police cars that are still on site, making sure no one's tamper with the crime scene. Thank goodness we have the brave people that risk their lives. Now, thanks to them, I got appreciation, and they told me I am allowed to come on the scene and just give a little tour of what happened. This was the brewery. You can obviously tell the damage that was done. It looked a lot worse beforehand. There was a bunch of holes in it, but they've been patching it up. The road looked a lot worse, as you can tell by the holes and certain things. This was completely blown up, but they've been working on it. Now this is where it gets really, really just scary inside. This is one man did all this. Imagine if someone helped him. Two people could have done so much more. This was in a matter of minutes that this action was taken. Imagine if he had more than that. What this city would be looking like right now. These businesses right here were personally owned by me. Right now they're out of order and not working. I'm probably going to have to let go just so the city has more space and time to work, rebuild. Right over here was a great friend of mine, Jay Ballen. He's a lawyer and business owner. His business was completely just demolished. Looked a lot worse a week ago than it is now. You don't even want to go up top, it's just horrible, but if we uh, go through this little doorway, you can tell the insides are not right. It's horrible. This business right here, this is almost a monument. The original stick bond tower building was going to be, but then was not large enough. That 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 right there, I can't believe someone blow that up. That's basically a monument. Something that was amazing. We want to go inside here. You can't even go up. It's just completely ruined. They had to cut the stairs off, and you see up there, some of the floors are just completely demolished. Let's get out of this. This is nowhere we want to be. Redstone doesn't even work. Another business that was attacked was the parkour building that was very, very much damaged. Uh, possibly never going to be used again. Another building that was completely demolished is this building right here. A um, young man was building this. Gonna make it something. Would have been great. There's not a chance of that ever coming out now. The carport place is completely demolished. There's no rebuilding this. It's gonna take so much money. Lava destroyed most of it. So it's basically ripped apart from the insides out. You can tell over here you have your lava and water mixed together. That brick building over there was uh, mildly damaged. But see folks, this is what can happen. This can easily happen to any city anytime if there isn't right law token. And I really think that if I'm your president, I will provide every single thing, 
every last effort, every heart, every blood drop, everything I can to make sure this city and everywhere else never has anything bad happen to it again. I watched this happen with my own eyes and it wasn't pretty and I don't want to see it happen again. And that's why I'm asking you to please vote for me and I can put a change and stop to all this. Thank you for viewing this and coming out. Hope you all have a great day.